What's up guys, this is Alex and today I'm bringing you some safe keys for the Sandy Cove's Convalescent Home which is in Salem in the middle right corner of the map on that little piece sticking off, looks like Florida, just on the other side. So Sandy Cove's the, uh, it's like a retirement home, here it is. That's the front door right in front of me over there which I came in, I cleared the place out, hacked this terminal and this terminal tells me which rooms have which keys to the safes which are right next to me on my right. So there's one behind the cap hole, the typewriter, underneath the paintbrush, under the fertilizer, in the favorite boat model, and under the mounted deer head. So we're gonna go ahead and go find these keys, so get out of that and go to your left. There's also a cap stash right there which is nice. But go left down this hallway. And the first room on the right will have the boat stuff in it. Also, there's the captain's hat, which I put on because I get to be a captain wearing the captain's hat. So go ahead and look around, and then the key is actually in this boat right here, which is Mortimer's safe key. And that's the first key you should find. So go ahead and leave this room, go down the hallway. And this is just a random room, there's nothing in there. It's just, it wasn't like a claimed room. So there's just junk in it, not necessarily something you need. So keep going, here's a hatch. Uh, I just opened it because it was cool. Hey look at that, there's something in the ceiling. Open that up and you can just drop down once you get up there. Oh, that's cool. Here we go, here's the next room, it has all the plants in it. And the key is underneath the fertilizer. So I was actually looking for fertilizer and I didn't think about like in bags, I was thinking just laying on the ground. But as you can see, it's right there underneath this bag of fertilizer. I'm just gonna go ahead and take those. And here is Margaret's safe key. Now that you have that, leave this room and go down the hallway. It should be the next room on the right. Nope, no, actually that goes upstairs to uh, the cat room. Here we go. And this one's behind the typewriter, this one's pretty easy. Edward's safe key is behind the typewriter in this room. I don't know why I didn't just grab it right there, I decided to go around. But there's Edward's safe key. Now leave this room and go to the right and make your way upstairs. You really could have just went to that room I turned into by accident, because that's actually the next room we go to. But I ended up going upstairs, because this is uh, Gladys' room right here where the cat's at. I don't need to show you going in there, because you already have the key for that room. You're allowed to use the bed and get well rested, and you can actually shoot these house cats. And you can get cat meat and make some something with them, a cat loaf or a... Not stew, make cat chops. So keep working your way down this hallway and go to the left into the cat room. See the floor kind of breaks apart where we were before and goes up here. And more cat meat, yeah. So go over to the cat bowls, which are right there. Teddy bear on the floor, which is good. And here's the next cat key. Cat key. Catherine's key, but that's probably why she likes cats, because her name's, you know, cat. So keep going here, and I think the final two keys are coming up. This one's underneath the paintbrush in this room. This one's actually really easy, because it's right there. You see the paintbrush? You don't even need to grab it. You can just actually work your way around it and grab Ethel's safe key. So, go ahead and do that. And, you know, I grabbed that paint for a different mission. Um, Abbott, back in Diamond City, wanted some green paint, so you need green and yellow to get not blue. You need blue and yellow to get green, all the way around there. And the final key is in this next room with the deer head and all this other stuff on the wall. The bass, the mole rat. So go ahead, I was looking around for a while and I was like, oh yeah, it's underneath the deer head. And it's actually underneath this pillow. That pillow right there. It's a comfy pillow. And this is Randall's safe key, which is the final key. So work your way downstairs. Don't take any buff jet like I did. I don't know why I took that. Maybe because I was like overburdened. I was just trying to uh, carry a lot of stuff. But here are the safes. So do you open easels first? Some mint hats, some stim packs. Next up is Catherine's cats. Red X, Red Away. These are mostly just uh, chems or stuff to heal you, mostly stim packs. There goes Randall, Edward, you got some jets, some medex, Mortimer, we got some psycho right away and stim packs. 
And we got one more safe, which is Margaret's, and she has Jet and Psycho. So that kind of describes how she is. So thanks for watching, guys. Please sub and like, and check out the other videos.